Hello everyone, peace be upon you all, welcome to a new video. So before I look into the last game and check out my mistakes, I decided to look into this match a little more, because uh, watching with our naive eyes, we will uh, we'll probably not notice the main mistakes, because uh, we don't know much about this match. So after some uh, look up, I found... Uh, I made this little document, but uh, it's still it's still not complete. I'll complete it now with you guys. This is a study video. So I have two games played by Viper. We're gonna watch them, and we have tons of wrecks again <laughs> with for death match. So we're gonna check out the uh, Viper's wrecks first. Uh, afterwards, uh, Viper videos, afterwards we're gonna check some racks, and then by that time we, we will probably finish this document, it's easy, we're gonna see if there's any changes or additions we'd like to add, or, or, or omissions, who knows. Uh, but, afterwards we're gonna check out the mistakes. We're n I'm not going to make a separate video for the mistakes. So let's start with 1 versus 1, death match versus democracy of gods. Okay. Let's reduce the volume. Okay. There's no need for it. I don't like Viper's music. <laughs> so let's get that. Let's get it going. Okay, it's gonna start now. So first, he builds in the red fashion. Build stuff. Okay. Attacks a villager. Then he runs to the corner. He sends paladins forward. Okay, he got back, he didn't go to the corner. He focused on another villager, but the scout is, is dead now. It's gonna get to build the castle, seek worship in town center. Okay. Okay, that's a point I did not add. Uh, it made this uh, tight below there. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe we'll change this. Uh, make it uh, eight ten centers. Wait, wait, wait. What? Did, what did? What was? Oh, uh, so four minutes, five minutes, ten minutes. So the average between these is seven minutes. So, eight town centers, at least, by ten minutes, and a monastery. Eight town centers, at least, by ten I, I don't think this is a point that I need to mention. It's... should be in mind, like, I'm gonna write it in the guidelines. Um... Eight town centers at least by seven minutes and a monastery. Monastery, okay. Uh, let's not make things a little tight, let's just make it open. Like, the Viper is not following a specific build order here, he just does everything at the same time. Building castles at hills in, in good positions. Give this rush, it's very quick. He's sending the units backwards. He's trying to lure them to the back and then attack with the other group. Kill villagers, trying to kill villagers. 
building more buildings. Gonna go back now because the enemy has many units, so it's unnecessary to attack. But he still can go to the wood the gold, like the secondary gold at the far left corner here in this area. You see a gold there. Okay, so he's gonna he's keep he keeps spamming. He's gonna cover over this hill. Build town centers. Rams. Gonna sit next to the relic. And protect the right side. He's gonna send units there to, to uh, cut anything that's trying to attack there. And that is true, there are units there. That's a fact. So. He has the monastery. Okay, six and a half minutes. Everything is built. So actually, let's let's re 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 change something. <laughs> Not seven minutes. Where where did that? Where did we write it? At? Hmm. Let's make it by six thirty. Six thirty minutes. Okay. And now it's just macro fights. Big fights. More buildings. Did we write? Did, you, did we mention that? Look at the map, build castles, town centers, villages. Now, fight. And more buildings. And. Okay. Put the helmet here in front. To lure the uh, fire, then get the paladins in behind, behind the LBD, and then the uh, couple of the archers fight. Yes, mm, not very good, but it's fine. His army is split. Democracy has his army split. Not the best micro by Viper. What's what's going on? <laughs> well, it's fine. Doesn't matter much. It's gonna fall back and, and uh, regain ground. Not a very favorable position to fight at because it's flat gr flat ground. You could fight from from hills and stuff. But he he wants map control, so he's not falling back to the hill. I believe so. I think. Okay. Oh, it's, it's amazing how relaxed he is. <laughs> My god. The Viper is so good, man. So good. I'm envious of him. I'm jealous. I'm honestly jealous. Okay, let's speed up a little bit. See that economy, more castles and map control, army fighting, siege. Let's not forget siege. Okay. Why is it? Why does the viper seem to have less army? Maybe. Maybe he has more villagers. He's building farms now. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Build farms around 12 minutes. Farms at 12 minutes. Farms at 12. Okay. Considering that Viper is late, for example. 
Because he has he's already low in food so Uh how that wood then? Wood is low as well. We'll see. He's still not making much wood villages, much lumberjacks. Shouldn't the gold be run out soon? If it does so, maybe he'll send the villagers to wood. That simple. <laughs> Sneaky trebuchets. Shouldn't it be failure? He's still not making it uh, oh, now. So if the gold runs out, he goes to wood and builds more farms. Okay, makes sense then. Okay, then should we mention this point? Uh, farms at 12 minutes. And then more farms and lumberjacks. Don't, I, I think this is self explanatory, it doesn't have to be mentioned. Like, when the gold runs out, what will he do? We'll obviously send it to food and wood. Let me try that. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh no! He's getting it closer. At least. Okay. Let's see. What will happen? He's raiding. Okay. This is getting to uh, late end point. Raid. I forget about that. R raid. Why is it? Why? 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 Raid. Round. Round. Twenty minutes. No, it's, it's just raid. In general. Raid. There isn't a specific time for it. Raid whenever you can. He's going away from the most uh, focused position to another position. And he's building buildings at that position. And then the enemy comes. The thing is... The uh, most of his buildings is uh, at the bottom of the map, where the fighting is in the middle. So it's tough. Oh. Never done this. Or maybe I, I've never played long enough to <laughs> to reach that point. Buildings, buildings at the sneaky side. Oh. Market. One second. No, never mind. I was, gonna, I was trying to see the market's uh, prices, but it doesn't matter that much.
something is coming from the left side. More castles. Shit. <laughs> Okay, this is a good attack from the side. Oh. Oh boy. It's almost over. What's this? Is it another market? I believe so. Mm, it's dreams. Yes, <laughs> you probably forgot that he has one. He already has one. Oh. Can I steal some relics? Oh, <laughs> relics! My god, he's so relaxed, man. Nothing happened. So easy. <laughs> uh, let's watch the other one. I think, I think he speaks in this one. Delete this. Yes, we don't need it anymore. Skip board. No. Yes, he speaks. A deathmatch, Han War. I haven't played that much for a while now, so... wonder how we'll do. <clears throat> You'll do well. Oh. We'll do fine. Okay, sorry, Don't worry. Oh. No yeah. summer, so... Can I skip? Because it seems to be bugging a little bit. Okay. Let's see. Put his comments in mind. He's building. Yeah, I definitely don't feel that my that my skills have improved as of late. That you can say for sure. You lost the build, yeah. Noob. <laughs> ah, this was slow. Should build the bags first to kill the thousands faster. It's fine. What's he gonna do? Where is he going with the army? Oh. Don't think yeah, I'm definitely not what I once was in that match. It's really hard to uh, be commentating while talking here, so I apologize up front for being less talkative. It's fine, bro. It's fine. Just I know. No, I shouldn't lag. I know your feelings. <laughs> I didn't speak a word last video. <laughs> Brain. The brain is limited to some to, to, to a number of tasks alone. Ah, uh, yeah, there's this. No, he won't. His army split. The other guy. The hell deers went for, to the other side for some reason. So we're starting correcting relics. Yeah, that fight turned out pretty damn well for me. It seems. I don't know why did the other guy do that.
That was, that was totally unnecessary. But unlike the way my units group like this, if you watch the downside of my screen now, you can see that they, the layout isn't the same as before. It's because I'm, I haven't changed that for that much. That's true. How, how did he, how was he like good before? <laughs> We'll see. We're gonna look at it again. Yeah, I'm in pretty good spot, I think. Just gotta get equal with Roland. Oh, damn. Yeah, this game should be mine. At least that's my lead of the game so far. It was definitely better last game, but it's not definitely better. Is it simply because the multitasking is harder? Is less good? Less good? <laughs> no, is uh, worse at multitasking right now? I think so, I, I don't think it's something like special. I'm in a pretty commanding spot right now. So I got like 65% of the map right now after I've taken out this. That gives me a pretty commanding spot. Oh! Oh! That's true. Map control. Getting buildings around the map. Okay. Didn't put that in mind. Get map control. by spreading buildings on the map and killing his buildings his buildings Hold on. I can even 
exact parts of armies out there, just to deal with extra damage to him. But he has more relics though, that's not a good thing. But his, his eco is taking hits, and he's fighting in the two castles, so... I should, I should have this game. I'm just sending out his raid crews. I'll try to close that up before he... Before he gets into the damage. Build a market. I didn't mention that. Market. Market. I like how I, I have did everything. <laughs> just one line, an entire list in just one bullet point. It's fine if he loses this. I want to lose a castle, but I still shouldn't. Shouldn't be game deciding or anything like that. I still have pretty cool there I can use for myself. It's It's seriously impressive, like... Like, you guys should realize how impressive this is. Incredibly impressive. My unit control so far has been pretty sloppy, I would say. Still good enough to not be in that position though. The only problem I want is that he has three relics, but I think I can use this goal now. So still gonna be enough. So he's adding skirms, Abdir's Hazar, means he's lacking gold hard now. Yeah, I I always like gold. I'm gonna use some good races, That's uh that describes me very well. Should win this game again too. Oh, it's got a lot of coverage now. But, uh. Didn't expect that. I like the gold bind. Just a massive paladins now. And, and it's 10 minutes. Push. He does. I think once I have, like, I get like, up to like 40 paladins, and I shouldn't be, shouldn't be able to beat that army. The extra buildings at the sides are usually just. Siege workshops, stables, and some barracks. Sometimes the, he don't he doesn't build archery ranges. Okay. Does he group the buildings together? Okay, I'm going to put my uh, like put my eyes, focus with my eyes. I don't know the expression, but uh, focus at the that at this panel and see if he picks buildings. Yeah. There is a group of buildings selected. Yeah, let's see. It's just millisecond. How do I go back? Yes. Okay. Okay, so you see he, he is selecting all the buildings at the start here, along with some buildings here and here. So he selected the main base, the center of all of everything, and the closest buildings to here. Like he deselect deselected these. Okay, okay then. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Never mind. Oh 
when I saw white here yeah, I thought we selected buildings but it uh, came out to be just yet. This still has a good shot. He has lost a lot of casts. So his holding points are pretty, pretty few now. Our next try will be with all these ramps. Trash Wars ram is really the deciding factor, you can say. Oh, nice. Just try to aggressive cast a and full push up with our ramps. This, I would assume this would be the game changer now. Let's make him move on my eco. At the same time, he's gonna, he's not gonna be able to stop this push down. But I don't know if I'm gonna be able to stop this push either. So let's see. This is tough. I think I was in the command position, so I think I would have won the game eventually. Did you just pick those? 
Oh, he's gonna play one more? Mongol too. Just soon. No. Okay. Okay, I think. Got a great idea. Now the game uh, goes. This time. Too loud. Too loud. No. Sorry. The button. Oh, it's sad how my screen is uh, much s s smaller than his. Look at my screen. Look at his. <laughs> Well, this will slow, this will go slower a little bit. I want to look uh, at it from a macro perspective this time. Like, how does it go from, like, from, uh, like, looking at the minimap. They don't build castles like the Viper does. Why? Oh, uh, they do, but, uh, <laughs> weak positions. How the hell is going on? Why did the uh, is it back on me? I can't help but feel that these guys are inferior to the Viper. <laughs> How he played. Although they're pretty good, I'm pretty sure they'd kick my ass any day. Well, he's going very aggressive against him. That uh, should be the reason why he's messed up a little bit. But he's still pretty good. I can't deny that. Look at the military. Spreading, spreading out. Oh, what did Viper do? I didn't notice. I didn't see the Viper building castles at the sides like this. It's actually really. I, I find it not not very good because it's gonna fall down. My castles are better when you are winning. You mean you know what I mean? But uh, if you build some stables and stuff here, wouldn't it be stronger? And why is it, why is it all <laughs> why is why is his entire army here? Shouldn't he attack? We'll see. Stop, stop attacking the castle, man! What the hell? What what good does that do you? Now, like building a castle here now would be would be fine because he's, he's dominating this area. But a castle alone is not enough. We should have some buildings along with it. Okay, okay. I think I think we're getting it better. I believe. He doesn't have any presence on the left side. And he's lost this fight. He has an entire army here to destroy these barracks. This uh, siege rams, that's not necessary. If this army was here, he might have, might have destroyed or stopped this. He also needs more rams than what he has.
Quentin ran. Bye bye. This is best probably gonna win. I think. Yeah, I think so. Never mind this. Let's look at another game. Okay. All these games are Jitba versus Enter Dimension. Is is there any new games like from the oh no. What's like Never mind. Never mind. Let's let's look at another book bridge. What the hell is this mess? No, don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do this. No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, that, that's the first game. That's the first game. Why did he do that? Why? Fight help deers with knights or paladins. Why he he does he has very bad fights. Okay, let's let's look at someone else. Why are we? What? What, what, what happened? Why is this respe perspective messed up? Uh, uh, now we should start from the other guy's point of view. Look from bottom to top. Why is it from top to bottom? <laughs> What's going on? Very odd strategy. Well, what, what will the other guy do? Should make tons of halberdier, tons of halberdier, tons of halberdier. You just need to make halberdier. If you only make halberdier, you're gonna win. You only need to make halberdier. Very few town centers. This hell is uh, playing for the advantage of uh, an atom. Who wants this? What should have he done right? What should have he done right? I think... I don't know. This map is really awful for him. Like this wood line and this hill. This uh, cliff. I think going from this side would be more better. Better. Like, he will force the fight if he comes from here. He will have to fight from here. He doesn't. Ha he doesn't need to worry about this. You could even wall this instead of these. Like, forget about these, and and wall this, and 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 go with everything in this direction. 
and focus villagers on the economy instead. He's, uh, the other guy is better. Yeah. Well, I don't think we're gonna get uh, any deeper insight after we watch the Viper. The most, uh, the deep deepest, deepest, deepest insight. How long was this video? Oh, 45 minutes. Okay. We're gonna look at the Viper's game again. Really quick. Let's look, look at it with normal speed. Actually, no. <laughs> I lied. So smooth, uh, so smooth. Incredible. That's just incredible. Well, let's look at my game. <laughs> my shitty game now. Let's look at how much worse am I than these guys. We're gonna find out any mistakes, obviously, from the first minute. Right from the get-go. Yep, this is not the best way to build buildings. <laughs> uh, I'm just spamming the buildings right now. And I should... I'm not counting. 7, 3, 4...
The raid is quite late, like look at him. He's already here and I'm still going. He was much faster. My grid is much worse, look at his. This is much, much more proper. Can't look at the mini map at all. I can easily kill my villagers. Well, I just lost everything. And I can't see, I can't even see his villagers. Like, I can't click them, I can't see them. Everything is messed up. But he can see mine very, very clearly. And I don't have, I have only three halberdiers. Look how many he has already. He has many halberdiers. No, that's not the right button. Look at how many halberdiers he has. My paladins died instantly. Are there villagers? How many villagers do I have? So... Let's speed up and see how fast I die. I didn't expect him coming from this side. Like, I should have expected that built castles in here. That's all. And uh, my, my, my building structure is bad, so that happened. What am I doing? <laughs> Where am I going? <laughs> Lost two barracks. I can't make Halberdy now. Look at how many units he made. How many units he trained. 60 more than me. My army management is better a little bit. But. Uh, his population is much higher. He's better in other, most other aspects. So... It's, uh... It's over. No rams. And obviously, can't push. Imagine if I had rams now, I could've actually pushed here. I, can, I might've even won. I don't have an, don't have enough gold either. Why didn't I expect that it, that this would happen? <laughs> it's so it's so obvious. Well, at least I got half the HP down. Yeah, this is my downfall. has map control not even trying to fight for map control decided to make a monk here to send it here but uh, that was too late it's already 16 minutes oh I have a lot of room for improvement I, I'm playing bad but I'm optimistic there is a huge room for improvement so that's really nice I'm gonna play a lot. I'm gonna practice for now to get better at death match. So I'm gonna put um first I'm gonna show you what I read. So the standard standard build order is the four stables, six barracks, then six archery ranges. The guidelines population at four at four at four at four minutes will be 110. About 110, but to be perfect, it would be 110. Eight town centers at least at 6 by 6.30 and Amman Street 
villages at 15, uh, for, uh, 80 to 100, farms at 12, build farms at 12, everything is one tile apart in a very neat fashion, the grid, the grid, the, like the buildings should be built in that way. Uh, fill the buildings by holding shift and uh, I didn't, I, I used to didn't, I used to do that before, but for some reason I don't do it anymore, so I should do it, so I, I wrote it to remind myself. Uh, getting good population is more important than raiding, in most cases, but just keep that in mind, I guess. How to play, click caps lock, send this cat forward, no patrol, uh, each villager builds a stable alone, in the start, three stables, each villager builds a stable and two barracks. Fourth villager build for Maxon. Not fourth villager. I changed my mind with this. Look at what the Viper did. The Viper built was not a, with uh, was not a, was not with a specific villager, but with all villagers. Look. No, too early. Takes a villager, builds a stuff, then bring it back. Use another, bring it back, builds, bring it back, builds, bring it back. See? That's much better, but it's harder. But, so, we aim for the hardest. <laughs> it's gonna be, it's not gonna be hard after practicing it for a while. Build four barracks and six archeries distribute, distributed justly. Look at your scout, kill one villager or two, then run to the corner. Uh, let your villager get attacked three times in garrison. Rally point your stables in three different locations in the back of your enemy's base. Use the first paladin to kill the scout. Then move, then move it forward. Control, control group the buildings. Rally point, rally point the stables and arch ranges at your base. After sixth, sixth paladin, paladin. Uh, Look at your paladins, kill villagers and run into strategic positions. Which, uh, with oh, I, I mean relics and other gold mines and stone mines and stuff. Use the first three to pull the, the enemy units back and use the other three to kill. Like, just micro around with the paladins to kill as much units as possible, as much villagers as possible. Build town centers, wall the villagers while building the town center if you have to. Mostly, mostly you'll have to rally all buildings out after the co the co counter forward counter raid. Uh, I have something in mind right now. Just a sec. Uh, to the direction you want to defend, or you want to attack. Hmm. You want to attack and defend from. That's the position. Like there might be a position that you, that you might be attacked from, but you won't attack from. Like, like from out, out to the position you plan to attack from. Remember the uh, game where the gray, the guy with gray made many paladins from the start and he walled the wrong uh, checkpoints and there was a cliff and a uh, stupid forest and he used uh, to crunch his, uh, his uh, units into a place that's very stupid to attack from. You should have walled that and built castle there, uh, there. He built castles there and send these units from the other position to attack. So you should gather the units in the position that you want to attack from and build castles at the positions you want to defend. Look at a map, build castles, town centers, villages, siege, get relics, fight, more buildings, raid, and market, and market, <laughs> and market. Get map control by spreading buildings on the map and killing his buildings. Built by buildings, I mean barracks, uh, stables, and seed workshops. As for castles, only build them if you have map control. 
build castles only if you have if you if you already have dominance if you have dominance dominance in that area area I don't know if that's the right part but uh, it, 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 I'm making it more complicated by but it's fine on the map and killing his buildings how to practice get the starting buildings and pop hundred at four minutes without trading then without trading getting right once without trading then with trading okay get the full build order correctly uh, practice for real against the barbarian other strategies these three stable rush the standard build order this is the three stable rush it we build four stables but uh, the first the first three get built first the fourth one uh, get built late so you'll have six paladins by the time the fourth stable is built so it's called the three stable rush because of that because you're gonna rush with the three stables alone by the time the fourth is built fourth is built you're gonna not rush with the fourth you're gonna rally the units out to the position you plan to attack from then after the counter raid it's enough it's not a rush anymore these two stables rush the one that i was attempting to do like one villager on a stable and two villagers on a stable then continue with the standard build build this is for a faster build like a stable will be built faster so you're gonna rush faster but uh, this is not necessary uh, i honestly won't do it unless i need to rush early maybe i don't know what when will that be the case anyway the early market build market and asap as soon as possible with all villagers you'll have higher score than the enemy and i'm just putting this out because if the enemy has higher score than you by a lot then he's probably during the early market strategy sell between 1500 and 2000 of food and food then continue with the standard builds defensive market and barracks build market as soon as possible sell more food than wood then seven barracks then eight archeries then four stables like the opposite pinu style build seven barracks and rush forward Build 7 archeries and rush forward and build siege rams at ASAP, no paladins. But uh, generally these 3 stable rush, the standard build order is the best. It is the standard build because it is the best. These are hard to do and uh, situational and unorthodox, in other words. But they could still be done, especially the early market strategy, it's, it's the most common. It's the most common of the unorthodox of the other four like these four this is the one this one is the most common the early market one other tips hans versus other sieves usually rush with over 25 units not just the six paladins don't make halves versus mines Aztecs, or incas unless you want want them as mean shields but that that's not necessary if you pick random sieve if you if you have paladins or heavy camels make stables at the start otherwise make pallet barracks except for chinese chinese makes stables at the start, start. uh references these uh these were very helpful joe is a starting guide most of this most of this is uh it's concluded from Jerry's guide, so what you need to watch it. And the Viper Deathmatch games, these I also put it down. And they started a standard build order in this website, and the uh, more site in DM in these articles. We're gonna put all this in the description, so check it out, guys. And uh, I hope you improve and have fun. Bye.